Inside a hive, whether in a tree or a beekeeper's box, thousands of bees work together in a warm, sweet-smelling home. Bees build their hive from wax, shaping it into perfect six-sided cells called honeycomb. The honeycomb is their nursery, pantry, and home. Three types of bees live here, the queen, the workers, and the drones. The queen lays all the eggs. She's the mother of the hive. Worker bees, all female, do everything else. Building, cleaning, feeding, guarding, and foraging. Drones, the males, exist only to mate with a queen. Every bee has a job, and teamwork keeps the colony thriving. Worker bees communicate with dances and scents, sharing the location of flowers. They control the hive's temperature, fanning to cool it in summer, huddling for warmth in winter. This cooperation creates the perfect environment for bees to live and grow. The hive is a masterpiece of organization and teamwork. The bee's life begins as a tiny egg laid by the queen in a honeycomb cell. She can lay up to 2,000 eggs a day, each carefully placed. The queen decides if an egg will become a female worker or a male drone. Fertilized eggs become females, unfertilized males. The queen lays what the hive needs, workers or drones. For three days, the egg rests while life forms inside. Worker bees keep the hive warm and safe, ensuring the eggs develop properly. After three days, the egg hatches into a tiny white larva. It doesn't look like a bee yet, just a small, legless grub. The workers are ready with food for the hungry new arrival. The next stage of the bee's life begins. The larva's only job is to eat and grow. Nurse bees feed each larva royal jelly at first, then switch most to a mix of honey and pollen, bee bread. Larvae grow rapidly, shedding their skin five times in six days. What a larva eats decides its future. Only those fed royal jelly throughout become queens, the rest become workers. When fully grown, the larva fills its cell. Worker bees cap the cell with wax, sealing the larva inside. The larva spins a cocoon, preparing for its next transformation. The larva stage ends, and the quiet magic of metamorphosis begins. The hive's future depends on the care and feeding provided by the nurse bees. Each larva's destiny is shaped by the food it receives. The transformation from larva to pupa is about to begin. The hive prepares for a new generation. Inside its capped cell, the bee becomes a pupa, a time of incredible change. The larva's body transforms, growing eyes, legs, wings, and the familiar stripes of a bee. This process, called metamorphosis, takes about 12 days. The wax cap keeps the pupa safe and the temperature just right. Worker bees tend the brood area, ensuring the next generation develops well. When transformation is complete, the new bee chews its way out of the cell. It emerges, a little wobbly, and is greeted by its sisters. The empty cell is cleaned and made ready for a new egg. The cycle of life in the hive continues. Each new bee is vital to the colony's survival. The hive is always preparing for the future. A worker bee's life is a series of jobs, changing as she ages. She starts as a cleaner, then becomes a nurse, feeding larvae and the queen. Next, she might build honeycomb, process nectar, or remove debris. Older workers become guards, defending the hive from intruders. Finally, she becomes a forager, collecting nectar, pollen, water, and propolis. Foragers work tirelessly, visiting hundreds of flowers each day. A summer worker bee lives only about six weeks, working herself to death for the colony. Every job is essential for the hive's survival. The hive runs smoothly because each bee knows her role. The teamwork of thousands keeps the colony strong. The life of a bee is one of constant service. Every bee's effort supports the whole hive. The bee's life cycle, from egg to adult, keeps the hive alive and thriving. Each stage is crucial, and every bee has a role. But bees do more than help their own colony. As they collect nectar, they pollinate flowers helping plants grow fruit and seeds. Many foods, apples, almonds, blueberries, depend on bees for pollination. Bees are vital to nature's balance, supporting wild plants and animals. Healthy bees mean healthy ecosystems. Their work shapes the landscapes we love. By understanding bees, we see how much they do for us. Protecting bees protects our food and our planet. 
Next time you see a bee, remember its incredible journey and the vital work it does. Bees are tiny, but their impact is huge. 